The city of San Francisco has officially accepted a statue commemorating the victims of Japan's wartime sexual slavery. The move has triggered a furious response from Japan, with the city of Osaka saying it will end its 60-year-long sister city agreement in protest. Eugene He reports. Back in September, a comfort women statue honoring those who were forced to serve troops in Japanese military brothels during World War II was unveiled in San Francisco. The first of its kind to be erected in a major U.S. metropolis, it sparked a fierce backlash from Japanese officials as well as far-right members of the Japanese community. The comfort women stories uh, generally propagated in this country are totally false. Did you see it with your own eyes? Who is lying? On Wednesday, two months after its unveiling, San Francisco Mayor Edwin Lee signed a document that formalized the city's acceptance of the monument. It's a notable victory for those who have been struggling to raise awareness of the historic truth of Japanese war crimes and the plight of the victims. The reaction from Japan was immediate, with the city of Osaka saying it will terminate its sister city affiliation with San Francisco, established back in 1957. Osaka Mayor Hirofumi Yoshimura had written a letter to protest the statue, saying its acceptance would impair the relationship of trust between the two cities. Other comfort women monuments in the United States include a statue in the city of Glendale in Southern California, as well as a memorial in the state of Virginia. Seoul and Tokyo have continued to clash over the wartime sexual slavery issue, despite a settlement that was struck in 2015 with the new Moon Jae-in government citing disapproval of the vast majority of the Korean public. Eugenie, Arirang News.